Hey guys, it's Woodif here, and welcome back to NASCAR 21 Ignition Crew Mode Part 6. As you see, as as usual, the game doesn't think I did the thing at, you know, Texas, so, or Coda. So, we're going to do what we did before, and we're going to sim it. I don't know why this is like, they got it, saved it, and I won it. Okay. We're going to the Coke 600. I mean, obviously, we're going to run last, and nothing's really going to happen, so... I, 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 this is going to be like, this part is going to be recorded in like a multiple day span, so it's going to take a, a lot of time, because I'm so freaking busy at, at work this weekend, the whole uh, New Year's Eve and all that stuff, so that's going to be terrible, and I don't know, well, let's just get the Coke 600 over with. I mean, it's just full throttle. There's nothing complex, nuanced about it. We'll see where that puts us. And 27th, I mean, that ain't bad, but I know, I just, but, I just know it's not going to, I guess it's not going to end well. All right, let's just get this over with. That's so sad, man. It's so sad that I, I have to feel like this is, this is just like, I feel like I'm going to a funeral or something. Like, I just... Well, this is why their stocks are at like three dollars and ten cents. Last time I checked, as of December thirtieth. So, yeah, it's amazing. And then they're probably gonna, yeah. Why the car spin? I, I don't know. Don't know. Well, there goes our race. We didn't even complete a lap. That's that's just sad. I like how I like how this track is just that hard to run. Like, we're in a five fifty fucking horsepower package. It, why? Why is it, oh my fucking god, it's such a fucking shit show. I, I, I just don't get it. I, I just, I really don't understand why the car is acting like this. I mean, Grant, I did spin out, so maybe that's why. Why am I even on track? Why am I even playing this? I could be fapping. Oh, oh, oh there we go. I wrecked. What a concept. Oh, there goes Larson. That's, that's Chastain. Wrong decade. C can we just have, like, a compilation of me just wrecking or something? Because I, I, it's just so, it, it, it's just pitiful. I mean, it is. I mean, traction's on high. We're in a 550 horsepower bullshit package. The car should not be acting like this. It's. It's on. It's honestly kind of amazing just how bad all of this is. What what else do I need to do? I guess I just gotta slow up in the corner even more. Maybe I should just go 120 in the corners and then I'll be fine. Or maybe I'll just wreck myself because. We're near lap cars, so... We're lead lap cars, so... I can't even... Like, what... I'm going... Uh, 140, and it still spins. Like, what the... What the fuck? Not we... Sp <laughs> Fucking God. This is unreal. This is... Uh, this is honestly unreal. This is, like... I, you know, I, I... What is this racing doing in me spinning out? I don't know. I want when I get a when I race, I want to be spinning out more than racing. That's that's what I like. What do I say? What can I possibly? I mean, no, actually, you know what? This is real life. This is that's exactly how these cars handle in the, with the five fifty horsepower package. Is that you have to go one hundred twenty miles down? I mean, that's I mean that's that's accurate. That is that is how it is. What like what am I supposed to say when it's not? When it's like this, I what 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 am I what kind of emotion am I supposed to? This is good. Consume product and buy next product. Like what what what? This, I I guess I gotta be the robot. I'm also just start popping and locking and shit because that's just more entertaining than whatever the fuck I'm doing right now. Like come on, man. Like what what am I? I got nothing. I got fucking nothing. I'm not. I shouldn't be sitting here experiencing this level of just incompetence like the way that this game is and how fucking bad it is motorsport games should just never make a game again this is one of those rare cases i mean i would just be happier without an ass cream I, I mean i really would things would just i would be happier i mean it i mean i definitely feel a lot better that this isn't just it's not like I, 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 this is like my only source of income now, like doing YouTube stuff, so like, that's nice. 
Because you can't fucking make videos on this game. I love it when people always say in Ramen's video, he's like the only person playing this game. And I'm like, hello, I'm here. I'm I'm still doing it. So, I don't, don't know. I mean, it's just embarrassing. Like, I can't even... F like, how many laps down am I? How this is worse than fucking Dover. We need to, I need to truly have, like, a spin counter. Post that or what if. You're gonna hate me for this, but make a fucking spin counter. Please. Like, this is, this is just pathetic. I guess I could just pit. But I should have to pit every fucking 20 laps because the car is just that undrivable. It shouldn't even be an issue to begin with. So fuck it, I'm gonna stay out. People are like, oh, you could just pit. Well, you know, I guess I should have just pit every 20 fucking laps. I guess that's the the method. Not even 20 laps, because it was getting bad before then. But then again, I spawned lap one, so I don't fucking know. Maybe every 15 laps. Like, I shouldn't have to do that. I shouldn't have to fucking do that. Fuck, it's just, Jesus Christ, man. Yeah. I mean, that that's what happens, game. That, I mean, I can't even fucking finish her. I can't even... I mean, this is honestly next level bad. Dover was fucking bad. This is this is transcended into like supernova levels of bad. Where literally working would be better than fucking playing this game, playing a game. That that's that's the level we're at. Like when but when will it end? I don't know. Hopefully you're fucking laughing. Subscribe for more whatever the fuck this is. How about that? I don't I don't know what to say. I spun out again. Add that to the thousands of other spins. This is just on a fucking default slider too. I should have just made it tighter, but I <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, man. Like, just, how many laps down am I? It's gotta be more than, like, six or seven or eight or whatever I was at at Dover. It's gotta be, like, ten. I'm, I'm gonna predict more than ten laps down. 130 miles an hour, and I just... I, what? <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Like, when, when? When will this fucking race end? The game literally just, like, almost, ex like, fucking exploded. Oh my god, man. Like, come on. Also, can I say how... It, like, if this game was actually, like, fucking functional... Why, in the holy mother of god... Do we have to adjust the pit options while we're fucking racing? Wouldn't that be nice to have that, like, done beforehand or... Or something, not, like, during the fucking race... It's bad enough how everything is, and then, like, God forbid, like, it, <laughs> this is what happens. This is what happens when you have Europeans make a game. They don't understand the concept of, I guess, racing anything, and you get shit like that. 112 miles an hour. 112 miles an hour, and I spun out. Literally, iRacing is easy, easier than this. I, I, I can't, it, I can get around the fucking track at least. Like, how, how does this, like, it's unfathomably bad. Again, I should have to sit here and fucking practice, like, 12 fucking hours just to maybe survive for, like, 25 laps. It shouldn't be like this. Thank God I don't have cautions on, because literally the game would just go on forever at that rate. Thank you, Gone. Add that to the spin counter. I, I don't care. I, don't, I truly don't fucking care. I almost don't even want to play this game anymore. I... I don't even know why I'm even bothering. I guess just to see how far I can make it on extreme difficulty and kind of show just how ex just dumb it is. Which I guess this is just another chapter in that legacy. I don't even know what, like... <sighs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you for killing me. 105 miles an hour. I, I mean, oh my god. I'm just gonna fucking pit, man. Fuck this shit. I shouldn't have to fucking pit to begin with. Or the car shouldn't just fall apart after once, but... Uh, fuck it. Who, who really cares? I, I just... What a fucking disaster. I don't know what the fucking speed is, so who knows? And my, and my AI spins out going 45 miles an hour. That's just... What a... What, when will it end? <laughs> 
Oh my fucking god, man. Like, this whole race could be its own fucking video. And my AI just missed its picture. Oh my fucking god. Am I just gonna be in an endless loop of bullshit where I'm just not gonna be able to pit? I, I mean, I'll be just be better off fucking simming it because I'll finish better than 40th. Like, what's the fucking point? I'm glad that there's more incentive to not literally race than to... Than to I like... Oh my god. There's more of, of an incentive to fucking sim the race when you're running this bad than to actually... It's just... What's, what's the fucking point? To people that actually hate ranting like this, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, what do I fucking say? I could just edit all this out and then just move on. I could I could be that. I could just be shady as fuck and just kind of, you know, edit out all the, the bad stuff and make the game look better than what it is. 30 miles an hour. Can the, can the car fucking handle that? It looks like it can. I'm glad 40, 45 just, it couldn't handle it. Oh, okay. All right. Well, I guess we're just, we're just fucked. I, I waited too long. Can I pit, please? Thank you. Fucking finally. Oh my God. All right. Well, maybe we can actually finish the race because it just got to the point where it was just undrivable. Just, just, I, I, I don't understand, like. I just don't fucking understand. Even if the, the right, even if the rear tires slip and stuff, what of all tracks? Why is it this one? We're in a 550 power, you know, package where there's so much stupid amount of downforce. The car shouldn't be sliding like that. It should be like how it is at other tracks. Again, this is one of those myriad of problems where not only the difficulty is out of this world, but the um, way the car handles doesn't really act like a 550 thing. Again, if you're gonna rep try to replicate that the stupid package, at least do it right. It feels like I'm on like a 750 package or something. Like it just has no downforce. Damage doesn't mean anything because it's off, but like, yeah, I don't know. Just I don't even know what to say. I just want I just want to get this race over with. Thank God it's the last lap. We're f 15 fucking laps down. Way worse than Dover. I just don't I just don't understand why it needed to be this awful. I, I just don't understand. I mean, th that th that was just miserable. Whatever. We, we finished. We're last. I think Harvick won because we wrecked so many times we, like, jacked up the entire field. So, I'm glad I single-handedly was, like, the outcome of the race. I was such a... a Kirk got 13th. I'll take it. Well, we got Sonoma. That'll be fun. Like, genuinely, like, in comparison. Yeah, it's... We'll see if we can win that, because that's going to be really or one of our only tracks, at least in this in this part, that I think we actually have a shot of winning. All right, I'm just going to... We'll see if we can make it to the next round with that lap time. It was like a 139.8. And it's fucking last. Oh, my God. Wow. I don't even know what to say. That is unbelievable. All right, well, our chances to win are pretty much out the window, so... Also, um, we made the car one click tighter. I think maybe that will help us, because in qualifying we're kind of on edge. So, yeah. It's going to try to stay out of their way. I just can't believe we got last. I didn't think our car was that bad. Granted, the times were decently close. Usually they're a lot worse than that. Like, they're a lot more spread out, but... Wasn't the case there. But yeah, look at that. Getting some spots... Which is always appreciated. The, ugh, the car felt really tight there. Yeah, I don't, I don't like that. Oh my god, they just... Well, you know what? You can think of it like this. We just gained like 20 spots. <laughs> we did we complete half of the lap and we already almost uh, gained 20 spots on everyone. So that's nice. Corey LaJoy is going to get by me. So that's another interesting element. But we'll get it right back. Oh my god, the Bendetto just left just like how he's left NASCAR. That's funny. I really wasn't trying to pass them there, because that's kind of not really the ideal corner to pass. But you know what? I'll take it. That's a spot nonetheless. Oh yeah, then we gotta worry about this corner where they're just gonna stop. So we gotta be careful. 26 miles an hour through there, huh? 
Well, in one lap, we went from last to 13th, so I'll take it. And now we'll try our best to slowly pick them off one by one. Oh, Logano wrecked. Yeah, I'll take it. Two spots. Don't know how Logano wrecked, but I'm not complaining. I'm just trying to understand it, but we're up to P11. And just like usual, this last corner is going to be our big opportunity to gain some spots. That's not really how I wanted to approach that corner because we... <laughs> Like, there was no attempt to slow down. I get hit. That's fair. Honestly, I can't even get mad at that because I just completely botched that last corner. So, I, I, I respect it, Blaney. He dished it. Ooh, he dished it right back to me. Call to Blaney. We should be able to make this pass this time around. I still overdrive it. I don't know how I'm doing that so badly. But we do get the spot. If we gain a spot every lap, then we can realistically catch the leader and win, but I, again, I think that's wishful thinking. Oh my god, Brad just like, I don't know. There's certain parts of the track where I just catch them, <laughs> like, really easily. And then other ones, it's they're okay. So I don't know. I just don't want to be behind them, because I just you just never know what they're going to do. I'm sorry, Brad. He didn't deserve that. I. Oh my god. I just want to have a clean fucking race. Again, a really good run through that second to last corner. We should... Oh my god, Harvick. Why do we Why do we go 20 miles an hour through the fucking hairpin? Whatever. We got our quota. We gained a lap per... We, get a, we gained a spot per lap. Now the good thing is Harvick's really far away from Logano, so we can we are able we should be able to get through this corner and not worry about the AI I mean stopping nearly as much, even though I did kind of hit Harvick there, but whatever we gain a spot, our quota is fulfilled. Well, back to our scheduled uh, one position per lap uh, corner. And we get the spot on Kyle without too much of an issue. Byron's stopping. Might get a oh are we gonna, are we gonna get two spots a lap? Nope, okay. Oh, we got a nose on him. Doesn't really give me too much room, but it's okay. Oh my god, Byron just stopped. It's okay. Ooh, okay. Oh my god. Alright, we should be able to clear him here. And we do. Okay. I think our our position per lap quota is going to end because um, fourth place is very far up the road. So um, top five might be all we'll be able to get. Nice thing about catching Austin Dillon is that before I could even see him getting through the last corner, now I can like visibly see him up in the distance. So that's nice. Don't know where the hell everyone else is. <laughs> I still have yet to see them at all. So they are just gone. White flag's out, and as you saw just before I hit the line, we are getting faster as the run has gone on. So like us making this car just just a tiny bit tighter is it's gotten faster. <laughs> Oh, I wish I uh, used this this thing in qualifying because I definitely would have been better than last. I mean, I still wouldn't be getting pulled. I would still be like three seconds off, so it might be like a slight increase. Because I'm only really like about a second faster from what I was in qualifying. I think it still would have helped. Maybe we would have had a shot to win if we had a little bit more track position. But yeah, we just lost too much time on the the start, or we just started too far back. Might be able to get Austin Dillon. Or maybe not, because I just screwed up that corner. So the last couple of corners. I know we can gain a lot of time on him. Again, I just feel like I'm too far back to really take advantage of it. Like, even if he slows up in this last corner, we're going to be a little bit too far back. Which is going to really hurt, because that one mess up... Yeah, as you saw, he just stopped. That's a, that's a fucking tease. Oh, that figures. That one mistake I did in the last lap, that cost us. That was the difference of the time. That's, that's, ugh, whatever. We got through it. That was a nice top, top five. And, uh, Denny Hamlin wins by over, uh, 18 seconds over me. So, uh, holy shit. Oh, <laughs> so where did Brad finish after I, oh, 15th? I'm, I'm sorry, Brad. I'll stop recording from here. I'll see where, wherever that takes us. Hamlin does win. He gets his first win of the season. So good for him. We only have 302 points, so we would be in around about 20th. 
So we still have a good cushion over 30th. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll, I'll see you all in a bit. Never mind, we're out of time. That trailer race took up a lot, and sorry for the weird audio not catching up in the game capture. I don't know why it's like that. I, I, I'm going to assume my game capture just didn't want to capture the audio for this game, which I honestly don't blame it. So that's kind of funny. <laughs> but, um, yeah, anyways, uh, thank you to my tier 3 Patreon supporters, the Dale Reynolds, Kamikaze Games, Ryan Lazar, and Dave Nurchamp15, NaskanOversight.org, Billy Kier, Golf Kill 100, Emilio Bepser, Mexican Lake 1986, Mark Harbin, and Jason Hellman for a donation again. I can't thank guys enough for your contribution and support to the channel every single month. And all the support, that's it means a lot. It goes a long ways, so I, I can't express it enough. So thank you, as, as always, from the bottom of my heart. I'll see you all next episode when we tackle uh, Nashville and the Pocono races. So um, that'll be awful. So uh, yay. Have a good day, everyone.